And back here in the United States, Republican presidential nominee Donald Trump has lashed out at Google in his latest interview. Speaking to Fox News, the former president accused Google of deliberately censoring information about the U.S. presidential race. Issuing a stark warning to the tech giant, Donald Trump said that Google could face a shutdown if it does not act more responsibly. And without providing any proof, the Republican claimed that Congress has plans to take strict and severe action against Google. Now, baseless allegations from Donald Trump certainly are not new. And the latest against Google emerged from some reports which suggest that the search engine was censoring images from the assassination attempt on Donald Trump on July 13th. Along with Google, Donald Trump also accused meta platforms of censoring images from his assassination attempt on Facebook and Instagram. Also chiming in tech billionaire Elon Musk, who has openly endorsed Donald Trump for president. Musk, who owns social media platform X, has been feuding with meta platforms and its CEO, Mark Zuckerberg, and has even challenged Zuckerberg to a fist fight. The Tesla and SpaceX CEO has also accused Google of implementing what is called a search ban on Donald Trump. The ex-owner also said that Google's search bar was not showing Donald Trump as a suggestion in the autocomplete feature. After receiving public backlash, Google accepted that its autocomplete feature did face technical issues which have now been rectified. Joining Donald Trump in criticizing big tech is his running mate J.D. Vance who has gone even further and called for the disintegration of Google. These attacks on Google by Donald Trump and J.D. Vance come after a federal judge ruled on Monday that Google holds an illegal monopoly as a search engine and has violated U.S. antitrust law. After the ruling, Google's parent company Alphabet saw its shares tumble by almost 5% along with decreased internet activity, reflecting investor and user concerns about how the company carries out its operations. Across continents, one powerful news source. Bringing you diverse perspectives on the issues that matter. We go beyond the boundaries to give you that little extra about every sporting moment. So thank you for making First Post 5 million strong. We're counting on your support and you can trust us to bring you the news unfiltered and unvarnished. Climate change is on our doorstep. It's time for a revolution to take root. And it starts with 1.4 billion Indians. It starts with one tree. One tree for humanity. One tree for Mother Earth. One tree for our future. Project One Tree, a News 18 Network initiative.